Hello there, birds and bees. Hit that like button if you don't want Dabby to set you on fire, or hit that like button if you do. Let's jump into this staple tutorial. Rather than using actual staples today, I'm going to be using aluminium craft wire. It is a lot safer, I find. It's not as sharp, which makes it easier on my skin. And not to cut those, I'm going to be using some craft wire cutters, because I can also use them like pliers in the methods that you're going to be seeing in a moment. So taking the end of the wire, we're going to bend a right angle and then move slightly along and bend another right angle, then clipping it off just at the end. And that simple, you have a staple. Great, did you have fun doing that? Cool, cause you're gonna be making a load more. I roughly worked out on my body by like, you know, pointing, counting, estimating, and looking at reference pictures. I would need about 40 for the amount of staples I was gonna be doing that were on the show. So I went ahead and did that and put them into piles of 10 just to make it easier as I went along. Now, once you have the desired amount, go ahead and pick out any who that have like one leg, if you will, longer than the other, or ones that are quite sharp, because what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be cutting those off, making them flat, and making them all even. You might also notice that I have various sizes. I tend to make smaller ones personally, as I like the ones around my eyes to be smaller. You also don't even have to even them off. Dabby is very, very rustic and a crusty, dirty boy, so if you want to just make them uneven, go for it. But yes, that is it for this tutorial. It really is that simple. If you want to see how I apply them all, you can go ahead and watch my Dabby makeup tutorial. Thank you very much for watching. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!